Knox County Talk, got a very windy medal lane. Um, no fan chats today, we're just going to give our reaction because we don't get much chance to do that other than the player ratings. There will be a player rating video going up pretty soon after this. But uh, wow, if you came down to support them today, obviously, if you didn't, there's been a lot of games, a lot of, lot of spending over the festive period to get games. But wow. Michael Doyle. Oh my gosh. Michael Doyle. What a goal. Close your goal of the season competition, it's done. It's done. I mean, everyone was screaming shoot at him, weren't they? I don't think he would, but he just lets it, it comes off his boot, and as soon as it left his boot, I was like, that's it. Yeah. It just, it dinks in, oh. If, if that was a league game where there was a few more fans, I think there was 2,300 there today, wasn't it? The noise when it went in as well. Like, Unbelievable. Three, three odd thousand there, what a goal. And he's what, 30, 36 or 37? 38. 38, he's played 90 plus three. He's been running around, playing well all game, and he's got the composure and the legs to do that. P inch perfect. Any lower, the centre-back heads it away. Any higher, it's over the bar. I think, you know, you know this period is, I think for a lot of fans, redeemed himself. Not that, for me personally, I, I quite like Michael Doyle. I liked him. You know, at the start of the season, he was a little bit give or take, but this festive period now, I mean, he has played unbelievable every game. And like you just said, he's played every minute, so... He's won the fans over and you could see when he scored the goal, everyone piled on him. It meant everything to the team, to him, and he ran over to the fans and wanted to celebrate with the fans because I think he just wanted to be like, I've scored, there you go. Like, sort of. I think for me that is a season defining moment, genuinely, yeah, because yeah, 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 there's yeah, no yeah. replay there's, now. There's just a the feeling that things like that did, didn't happen to us and hasn't happened to us for a long time. It seems to go the other way where the other teams are doing it. And for us to be doing that now, I mean... It just feels like everything's sort of going our way at the moment, doesn't it? Yeah, and then the fact there's no replay, because let's be honest, they were here for a replay. They were here to get the replay. First off, they sat deep, didn't they? Yeah. They, they, I think they had like one, maybe two shots max. And their goal, like, oh. I mean, Fitzsimmons, Fitzsimmons pulled off an unreal save. I, I mean, feel he sorry might have pulled him. three or four off in it, we couldn't tell. But <laughs> yeah, they crowded one. Um, I mean, it was anyone's game, yeah, but, wasn't it? You know, the players that have come in, it, they, they are good players, but if you're not playing regularly, it's going to be difficult for you. And I thought, Notch controlled the game for most of it, um, and the only chances Dagenham got were set pieces, um, and when not pressed forward to get the winner, because you could see Audley was not having a replay. Yeah, yeah, they, they were a tough side. I think you know you have got to give them a bit of credit. I think you know they were they were here to rough us up, and they they did quite well. Kelly Evans always seems to have a bit of a duel with someone, doesn't he? And he he was just well, he was up for it today, wasn't he? Like he always is, and he, he gave as good as he got. Yeah, I think. Keeping the tactics the same as well, consistent. <laughs> you've got players in here now, Crawford. You've got uh, players that don't get as many games at the minute, um, Shields, and they've come out with a win. So every player in that squad is experiencing victories and last minute uh, winners or... It's showing a, a bit more depth to the squad. Definitely, yeah, yeah I, I know what you're saying there. Yeah. Um, more on the game if you didn't come. So not controlled 85, 90% of it. Um, the referee was abysmal. Yeah, like the goal that didn't stand for us, I think we had a goal disallowed. It was 20 Tom, minutes in? Yeah. Thomas, was it? Uh, no, it wasn't. It was McCrory because it was from the set piece. We scored and then the ref pulled it back because either, I think it was the wall. Yeah, I'm hearing their wall was not far, far enough back. But we're being we're being uh, targeted there for their like, issue. So. Well, that's not our fault that their wall's not exactly. far enough back. So the refs had a shocker there. I, think, I, th I, I mean, it sounds daft, doesn't it, now saying we could have had two penalties, but... For me, there was two Stonewall penalties today. Um, their free kick that led to the, to the goal, not a free, a free kick. kick. <laughs> not a free kick, but, you know, that's all out of the way now. Could be moaning about the ref, but um, it's the worst worst performance I've seen out of Medley in this season, I think. Yeah, yeah. In, in terms of officials. Um, mo anything else on the game is just... It's, it's just, like... I couldn't be happier. No. What, away from what performance. Credit to Dagenham fans, 151 for an FA Trophy just after the festive period as already mentioned I mean look you can tell by us you can tell around the ground when the final whistle went the feeling around Notts County right now yeah, it's is very good. it's not been this good so for positive. years yeah. yeah like it's not been this good since Monto Finance and you know that was that was built all off uh, false hope wasn't it so yeah keep an eye out for the player ratings they'll be coming uh, very shortly after this video but good times in Notts County and we're on our way to Wembley if we carry on winning these games. Absolutely, yeah.